That fell over off my, off my stool. Hey, gang, Kevin here. <sighs> Coming to you from the Salty Dog Outdoors, man, okay? Got a Alec Bradley American today. And I've got three or four bottles of whiskey here. Close. I think we're going to go with some Rusted Crow. Bunch of stuff is coming up, coming up my feed since uh, they offered me a chance to get monetized. Uh, that's basically how to get monetized and how to grow your channel and do all that kind of stuff. I don't look at that stuff, so I don't know why it's coming up in my suggested feed. And oddly enough, my own videos are coming up in my suggested feed. I don't know. Lori. Let's see. What we talk, want to talk about. Trump trial. Not going to talk about it. Didn't expect anything different. Like I told you all before. Zero way to get a fair jury. Uh, or an unbiased jury. Especially not when you... Go to a place where the jury's going to get padded anyway. Am I saying Trump's, Trump's uh, innocent? No, I'm not. Am I saying uh, they're pursuing stuff that they would not, would not normally pursue? Yeah, definitely. Uh, of course, this opens the door with Biden and all of them coming up and saying, uh, saying Yo, this, is, this, this proves that nobody's above the law. Remember that when it's your turn. <laughs> I saw a thing, Robert De Niro crying. We don't want him in my town. I didn't know he had a town, Robert. Mm. How much did New York off? Uh, and uh, my favorite thing that I've seen all week, and this is taking up the mantra, so this is what this is going to be about tonight, the economy. Uh, I watched somebody asking President Biden questions, and it was economy questions. And the guy with a straight face said that the economy has never been stronger in recent history. I don't know how recent he's talking about. Uh, but he did mention the previous administration. And he did mention other things. So uh, I guess he's talking about the last few years. And then, of course... They all took up the mantra. The economy hasn't been this strong in forever. Piece of cigar wrapper. And it made me wonder. Do they believe their nonsense? Uh, and if they do believe it, why? And if they don't believe it, why do they think we're dumb enough to believe it? And uh, I guess it's I guess it's this way. You got Robert De Niro grabbing about trunk. This guy does make believe for a living. That's his job, playing make believe. Uh, along with all the other actors, it's their job to play make believe. So, do they have a grasp on reality? Some of them do, some of them don't. Most of them don't because they honestly believe that everybody lives like they live. Uh, the economy. Uh, this. We've got people who don't buy their own groceries, don't pay for their own gasoline, uh, don't do any of their own shopping for themselves, and don't have any idea how much stuff costs, especially in the context of a normal day's wages. And uh, uh, I'm never one to say living wage uh, and, and gripe about this, because here's the deal. If you agreed to a, to a, to a amount of money to do a job, 
then you don't get the gripe that it's not more later. Uh, don't agree if you don't like if you don't like the pay. And uh, before you get, I don't have any choice. Uh, everybody's got a choice. You got a choice to either go get another job, go find another job, or accept what they offer you, or negotiate. And sometimes you can, sometimes you can't. Uh, some folks, some folks in my life have found out you can't negotiate. Uh, but these folks have no context of what daily life is supposed to be like for an American. And, uh, it's sad, uh, because back many moons ago, many years ago, uh, all these jokers didn't spend all their time in Washington. Uh, Congress, Congress wasn't in session year round. Uh, these people weren't getting flo flown all over the world for junkets to other places uh, that they had no business going because they can't negotiate for the U.S. Uh, so basically, none of these people are among the people. So it's a sad, sad thing. You got these people trying to represent us. They say leaders, but they're not leaders. They're representatives. Uh, and uh, they don't know how. That's the whole problem. Uh, the economy is not strong. Uh, I know how much stuff cost me, and I know how much stuff, the same stuff cost a few years ago. And everything is higher, whether you like it or not. You can say it's not, but it is. Okay, with all that being said, uh, in the world of Salty Dog Outdoors, me, uh, you're looking at my entire staff. Uh, got class this weekend, so I'll be on the road. Uh, I can't promise I'll get a couple of videos made this made this week. Uh, I've been trying to go through this whole monetization thing, and it's hoop after hoop after hoop. Okay, hey, you pass this step, now do this step. Hey, you pass this step, now do this step. Oh, you pass that step, now do these things. <sighs> Just say yes or no. It's not that hard. Uh, anyhow. Alec Bradley, American. I would definitely do them again. I like Alec Bradley's, most of them. Uh, on my table. Good thing I got paper down on the table from where I've been making salves and stuff. Uh, and uh, Russell Crow, you've seen me do this before, so you know I'll do it again. Uh, I got some things in the work. Uh, I've had some folks uh, wanted me to look at some stuff for them. Uh, and uh, I'll be honest with you. I hesitate to look at stuff, products, and things that people have made and all that kind of stuff because I'm going to be brutally honest. And uh, I figure if you want me to look at it, you better be ready. And uh, if you send me something to look at, I'm probably going to do a video about it. So uh, keep that in mind before you ask. See you all in the woods. I got my camera just a little too far away. <laughs>